Liftoff will start in T minus 10 seconds. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. We have ignition. Ever pondered the existence of Bigfoot or the Loch Ness Monster? Welcome to the intriguing world of cryptozoology, a realm teeming with enigmatic creatures and unexplained phenomena. Cryptozoology, for those who are unfamiliar, is the study of creatures whose existence is yet to be proven. Cryptids. From the elusive Bigfoot, the aquatic terror of the Loch Ness Monster, to the cryptic Chupacabra, these entities have sparked curiosity and intrigue for centuries. But have you ever considered turning this curiosity into a career? The journey to becoming a cryptozoologist begins with an insatiable curiosity and a keen interest in the unknown. This passion is the fuel that drives the quest for knowledge, leading to a pursuit of education in related fields. Zoology, biology, and anthropology are excellent stepping stones to understanding the fundamentals of animal life and human-animal interaction. Once these foundational stones are laid, it's time to get your hands dirty with fieldwork. The thrill of adventure coupled with the mystery of the unknown is what makes this job so unique. But remember, it's not all fun and games. The wilderness can be a dangerous place, with threats ranging from harsh weather conditions to encounters with other, more established wildlife, like bears. Always ensure that someone knows your whereabouts and equip yourself with the right tools to stay safe. Gathering evidence is a critical part of cryptozoology. High-quality cameras, sound recording devices, and even plaster for footprint casting are all essential tools of the trade. Remember, the cost of getting started in cryptozoology can vary, depending on the tools and resources you choose. Building a team of like-minded individuals can be invaluable during this journey. The camaraderie, shared knowledge, and support can make the difference between a successful expedition and a fruitless journey. In terms of research, start with the cryptids that have the most evidence. Bigfoot and the Loch Ness Monster are prime examples. These cryptids have numerous sightings and a significant amount of evidence supporting their existence. On the other hand, creatures like the Chupacabra have less evidence, making them a more challenging yet exciting subject to study. When it comes to choosing the best places to study, it's all about the cryptids you're interested in. The Pacific Northwest is a hot spot for Bigfoot sightings, while the Scottish Highlands is the place to be for Loch Ness Monster enthusiasts. So, to summarize, cryptozoology is an exciting field that combines curiosity, education, and adventure. The journey to becoming a cryptozoologist begins with a keen interest, followed by education in related fields, and culminates in thrilling fieldwork. The cost of getting started can vary, but with the right tools and a dedicated team, the world of cryptids is at your fingertips. Remember, safety is paramount, and choosing the right cryptid to study can set you on the path to success. So, are you ready to step into the unknown and unravel the mysteries of cryptids? The world of cryptozoology awaits. Subscribe and turn on all notifications so you don't miss any of our weekly uploads.